Come on. What the hell are you doing? Just running back and forth. Hold on, what's back here? I didn't finish exploring. Wait, I'm going backwards, aren't I? Yes, I am. Whoops. Here we go. Uh, is it gonna let me through? What'd you say? Requires a high-ranking officer's eyes. It's time to find where Abbott lives. Oh, so I can ring everybody's doorbell, huh? Oh, I can't shoot those. Is this Abbott's place? Nope. <laughs> We're building a better future. No to crimes. Yeah, easier said than done. No to crimes. Just say no to crimes. There we go, fixed. Shit. Yeah, I think the first shot of this thing is actually very accurate. Yeah, there is no uh, aiming, like, cone of fire type thing. If you keep firing, it does get a lot less accurate. But I think the first shot is actually very accurate. But there is bullet travel time, so you do have to make sure they're staying put. If you want to hit them in the head with one shot. Didn't talk to something for you. He lied. He's out now. Looks like you're here for good. Can't shoot it.
Something's going on here. Oh, Abbot. Not sleeping anymore. What are you doing? You are insane. Eat some lead. <laughs> what? Okay, I have him now. What the fuck? Is he holding his weapon gangster style at the wall? Is that what he's doing? Amazing. Something's going on here. What the and I'm taking a look. Holy shit. I regret exploring back there. Well, you feel that? It was this one, right? Came up with a shotgun. Man, leave me alone. You've hurt me enough already. I'm busy. Alright, see if he comes out now. No. Listen, I noticed something. Gonna take All right, well, I'm going to explore back there regardless of whether somebody comes out with a shotgun this time or not.
I need to know what's back here. It's probably nothing worth a damn, but still. Wait, no, this is where I, I'm, I don't even know where the hell I am anymore. Never mind. I am very confused. Did I went here and then I went back, right? Come on, I see your flashlight. That was anticlimactic. Rifle case. What does that do? Nothing. Is that an inventory item? It is. Abbott's special order rifle. Huh. Can I use it? Ah, Abbott's place. Let's pay him a visit. I need some eyes. Don't confront Abbott yet. No, I think it's time to uh, confront him. I suppose I could try to trick him. I got a package. Finally, must be my new rifle. Enter. He didn't recognize my voice. Who the fuck's in my apartment? Uh, the guy you asked to enter. Ah, I see you're a boss fight, so you magically have more health. Let's go, motherfucker! Hot lead for your motherfucking ass! Long enough. Even though Abbott's a cocksucker, I'm going to suggest strongly that you not kill him. At least not until I get my plus 50. Now, you and I are leaving Butcher Bay. 
Not bad, Johns. Someday, you might just learn how to do this for a living. Going somewhere with my prisoner, Johns? But not today. I should just have them put slugs in both your heads, right now. Why ruin a nice carpet? Oxy. <laughs> it was just a matter of time and I was gonna bring Ritter back to you. <laughs> How about our agreement, Johns? I'm willing to give you 20% on Rit. Hmm? Or should we keep negotiating? Call me crazy. I think he wants to hold out for more. Hmm, you could be right. 22%. I'll take it. What do you say? 22%. Nobody steals my property from my house, Johns. Now get the fuck out of my slam. You got it. <laughs> All right, Hoxie. What to do? What to do? Hmm. I've got entire regions rioting. My slam has become a damn war zone. I'm losing men faster than I can replace them. And all of this unrest, well, it began soon after you arrived, Riddick. Could be a coincidence. Oh, don't sell yourself short. I can see why you've earned your rep. You almost killed my second in command today. Just working my way to the top. Even more reason for me to bury you deep. I'm sending you to the mines, Riddick. Down below the surface where the sun never shines. You'll be the target of every calm looking to make his bones with the Achilles. I expect things could get ugly. I'll be disappointed if they don't. Some of the other slams I'd been to, Butcher Bay had a detached deficiency. It could contain the cons, but could never control them. So inside the gray walls was chaos, desperation, madness, and death. It's burning at my head! Uh, I... oh, oh, you gotta help me! You can help me! No, hey! No. Stay away from me! You can't push me away! Back off! <laughs> Can't say I didn't warn you. <laughs> oh man. You're in violation. Oh man, no. Wait, wait. No, 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 Security turrets were a real crowd pleaser to everyone except the janitors. Usually you take the road down to hell. I was going up. The Hawks spoke of mines. Commerce needs transportation. So do I. Down below where the sun never shines. Quite perfect for my special eyes. Aha! 
Smoking parents burn babies. <laughs> what? Hurry up, man! Ha <laughs> look, he's learning to fly. Rotten fruit falls hard in this shithole. <laughs> <laughs> and lands even harder. Jesus. All right. Uh, where do I go? Oh, Hurry up, up move! The elevator's the other way, stupid. Are, <laughs> are they gonna have anybody to work the mines if they just fucking kill everybody? As soon as they step off their transportation shipping containers? Jesus. Okay, I can do this. Get inside. I can do this. Now leaving. Tower nah, nah. 17. We'll talk later. Dude, dude, what are you doing? Not smart. Not smart. Good job. Whoa! Oh, is it because I dragged a body that means now I'm an enemy? <laughs> I guess I have my answer as to what happens if you drag a body in front of a guard. Of course, it was one that the fucking guard himself just shot, but whatever. Get inside. Uh, let me the hell out of here! Let me the hell out of here! Let me out of here! Let me the hell out! Back off! There, what a mess. My sincerest regrets. Seventeen. Base. Not now. We'll talk later. Ready. Spare a moment, huh? I know some things you'd want to know. Getting out of Max is one thing. After you show above ground, some even think you're gonna push Jack of Valance down. But Double Max is quite another. People are watching you. They never see me coming. Till it's too late. Jagger is the one down here. So far. Point is, there are rules. Look at the circle over there. Your Double Max home ends with this hall unless you step into the circle and defeat a blue skin. Centurion arranges all the fights. Talk to him. And talk to Dog Bone. He might help you get down to the mines. We know you, Riddick. In fact, Jagger's been asking about you. But things here are more complicated than you heard. We need proof. You need to either kill Bam in the ring, or manage to find your way into the drug interrogation room and beat the shit out of Abbott. You like the ring fight? See Centurion. Wanna buy some drugs? See Tutan in the courtyard. Okay, got a choice here. Hmm. Both sound pretty good. Let's see if I can get into the interrogation room or whatever that was. I don't want any trouble. Stay away. Oh my god, it's the fish people from Call of Cthulhu, Dark Corners of the Earth. A step back, newcomer. It's my dream to work in the mines and meet Jack of Valance. I can't get out of the courtyard without fighting, though. Blueskins have me trapped. Hey, man, how's it going? Got a med station back here. I'll let you use it if you pay me. Hmm. Nah, I'm good. No need. The yard is off limits, punk. All right, where the hell is two tongue?
I'm guessing I would need a pay to get back here. If I wanted to talk to Two Tongue. How much money do I have? I've got 85, sure. I'll pay. Got a med station back here. I'll let you use it if you pay me. Done. Or maybe not. Alright, so once again, where's this two tongue? You want to get the Jagger? You have to talk to Dog Bone. Okay, I guess I'll just do the fight. If you want to fight in the ring, Centurion's just. Hey, Riddick, let's go. Time to get into the ring. Set it up. A fight will cost you five UDs, but I'll let you in free. Try not to disappoint. Just send me a victim. I can't initiate any fights. Slam rules. So you have to find a victim, as you say. I suggest Herman, the blue skin at the gate. Challenge him, then come back here. Sounds wonderful. Kill you. I get past. <laughs> that sounds like a challenge. Let Centaurian know I'm ready to beat the shit out of you. Great, you have a challenger. Prepare to fight, Riddick. All right, we have a fight. We have a fight. The infamous Riddick against Herman. All bets are off, and remember, 5% goes to Jagger Valens. Okay, there are only two rules. One, do not step out of the circle during the fight. Rule two, stay in the circle until one of you is dead. Gotcha. Hey, he just stepped out of the circle. Was that disqualifying or something? <laughs> that was easy. This time, Riddick, but to get somewhere, you're gonna have to fight and win. <laughs> no fucking recreation area. That shouldn't be hard. Feed ward. Alright, let's find this two tongue. Okay, so I guess I need to either continue fighting or do this whole two tongue thing if I want to get to the mines. So I only needed to defeat one just to get to the courtyard and the rest of this place. Listen. Cricket's got the best shivs you can buy. I got a custom-made, bloody sharp shiv. Cuts through a belly like a soft-boiled egg. You sound very excited about that. Alright, well in my experience, the shiv is frankly... almost seems worse than just using your fists. Scratch. So, I'll just stick with my fists. Hey, well, looky here. He's clean. Get out of here. Oh, that just happens every time I go here. Oh, God. Hey, can well, can I skip this? <laughs> I can't skip it. It's a good thing I didn't buy a shiv. He's clean. Get out of here.
thing looks juicy. Look at that. Oh, shit. Seriously? I try to punch a fucking bug and I get killed? Wow. Oh my god. Leave me alone. Well, go away. Have you no respect? I suppose it is kind of rude. Leave me alone. Hey, man, you want to buy a few smokes? I can sell you a pack of smokes. Or maybe you need some info. Huh? I'm your man. Give me some. Okie dokie. There you go. There's a big mining area underneath us, right? It's off limits to everyone. But Jack of Valance is down there, so I hear. Section D is an entrance, if you want to take a look. And if you want something other than smokes, say hello to Monster in the diner. Monster is connected, and he is cute. Alrighty then. What the hell should I do? I need to get him, but there's no way I can get the ship through. There's an old trick you can use. You have an old style filter smoke and a lighter? I'm gonna smoke the bitch to death. No, you dumb fuck. <laughs> you burn the filter and work it into a needle. It's kind of fragile, so you don't want to work it too much. Stab him in the neck and he's done, man. Shit. I heard of that thing, of course. That's what I'm gonna do. Well, you're gonna need some practice, so take it easy. Some guys can smell that shit from miles away. Yeah, sure. Thanks. I've never seen you before. You want to make an impression? There are two PP members in Section A of the courtyard. Those bastards stole the red tube that I really need. Find out where they stashed it and bring it to me. I'll pay you. Hmm. All right, maybe I will. Hmm. I'll check it out. You're Riddick, yeah? Heard you pulled off some stunts in the circle. Say, you got a mining job? No. Need one. Impossible, unless you get assigned by the warden. Reason I ask is because I want to know if Jagger Valance is still around. I'm going into the mines. If Valance is there, I'll find him. Hey man, wanna try your luck with the dice? Um No. Forget it. Hey man, how about you uh, help me collect some debts? And I'll lend you money. I heard you're a pretty good fighter. Okay. Who owes you? Binks. One of the K3 guys in the diner. But you can't do him with muscles. Get some poison, drop it in Bink's food. Yeah, but don't kill him. I'll make sure he knows I'm the sender of that message. You want me to poison somebody? All right. Where the hell am I gonna get poisoned? What is that? I never heard of him. You know the vents go all over this place. There's one that goes from the dining hall over to Zodus Land in Tower 19. Yeah, and? Anyway, Padilla, the crazy mother, he's been saving up butter and grease for the last two months or so. So what? And he's also been looking for this guy, Cipriano, who used to run drugs. For the Serenos? Yeah, yeah, I know. He's been running milk for the Serenos, but he's double booked with Azolus. The Serenos found out and ordered his head. So Cipriano's are in a sack full of fuck? Yeah, but he has some crisp connections with Zolus and goes to ground in Tower 19. That's where he's been hiding the last couple of weeks. 
And this guy Padilla, he takes a contract? Right. He's been really busy trying to find a way to get into Zodus land unnoticed. And he figures... Oh, the vent. You're getting ahead of me. Of course the damn vent. Well, this Padilla... He's kind of big. Oh, okay, yeah, yeah, for the vent. I said, don't get ahead of me. <laughs> yeah. So, he strips and greases himself up, then goes into the vent. Well, all that lube works a little too good, and he slides right down to the first intersection. <laughs> well, he gets himself wet, right? Well, you tell the story then. <laughs> all right, all right, man, I'm sorry. Well, it ain't long before the creatures get a whiff of all that butter and grease. Padilla was so much seasoned meat. When the axe find them a few days later, there ain't much left but stain and a stick. <laughs> <laughs> oh, shit. Oh, that reminds me, I'm hungry. <laughs> that was amazing. What, you want to front me? I am Sorenos. You want to see the PPPs? Check the A section. Want to front me? I don't even know what that means. Want to front me? Does that mean fight? Hey, homie. You want to trade drugs? All right. Do me a favor. Sure, let's help the junkie out. Tell me more. Okay, I need your help on two things, man. First, I need my injector back from the PPPs. Look, Gulag has some history with him. He'll tell you more. Second, Basim is really bumming me out. So I, I, I need you to waste him in the ring for me. How about it, man? Sure. Doesn't sound too hard. Hey, you want anything? The mines. Tell me everything you know. You really want to go down there? <laughs> like Jack of Valence? That's why I asked. There's a door beside the work pass checkpoint. It's got a lock. The only ones that have a key are the guards, the high ranking ones. If you can manage a one on one with an officer, you might be able to steal his key card. And this Jack of Valence? He a problem? Problem? <laughs> nah. He's goddamn king in the mines. Live on what they find in the rock. Everybody pays in percentage. I'm not gonna help you get down to the mines, if that's what you want. It's impossible. The mines. I need to get to them. You should talk to Flores in the courtyard. I just work down there. It just got off my pass, and I'll be damned if I didn't forget my glasses. If you're going down there, could you check around uh, the big elevator in Upper Mines? Uh, sure. I got a thing for eyes. <laughs> I gotta speak to a few people, and beat a few people up. Go take care of Binks, and I'll lend you some money. Get my red tube back from the PPPs. I don't know where they stashed it, but maybe you can find a way to get it. Hey man, wanna try your luck with the dice? Forget it. Hey man, I really need to know Jack about. There's a big mining area underneath us, right? It's off the list. Show me some proof that all the blue skins are gone and I'll give you a reward. Okay. Done. Gotta poison people, gotta beat people up, gotta find a stash, gotta find some glasses. Listen, Cricket's got the best shivs you can buy. Oh, wait a minute. This like is. I, said, talk to Cricket I just realized it's an R uh, to skip. Which is a very strange key to skip dialogue, but maybe I could have pressed that before. With these guys. I don't really want to try it, though. Seen her. <laughs> that 
That's BS, and you know it. Hey, I swear on my mother. Swear on whatever the heck you want. It's still BS. I ain't bullshitting, Trigo. I promise it's true. Nah, nah, shut up, Suni. Get your goddamn head checked by a shrink or something. Hey, I've done that before. Ain't no fun. Oh yeah, we'll do it again, and let him this time analyze your mind like that guy Sigmund Floyd. Sigmund. <laughs> Sigmund Floyd. <laughs> Floyd, man. He was the psychic <laughs> professor from a long time ago or whatever, and uh, had this idea that all guys want to screw their mom or something like that. And uh, also, he discovered the mind and uh, other stuff like uh, the cerebral stuff. <laughs> Brilliant. The mind? Yeah, the mind. You know what? Shut the hell up, okay? I'm trying to explain. Relax. You. Sorry, Holmes. Anyway, this guy. He like discovered the mind and shit and everything. Dreams, subconscious, hypnotizing, and fucking who knows what else. You I'm don't doing. say. Now that is hardcore. Yeah, Sigmund Floyd. <laughs> Get out of here, Maestro. Cuellas is our man. Hey, talk to Cuellas. He's in charge here. You got a problem, huh? The Serenos' blessings don't come free. Get it? We got a list from a guard with the names of some snitches, but some asshole grabbed it. I want to know who, and I want that list. I find anything, I'll let you know. So, um, how are you enjoying the show? That's where they take you if they don't want witnesses. No surveillance there, man. Nothing. No surveillance. You hmm. like that? This is Whoa. for killing Harmon! And this is for attacking me. Yeah. That feels damn good. Oh, poison. Why did you have poison on you? Oh well, I won't question it. Fuck off, man. We're busy. Too busy standing, staring at the wall. You want some free advice, buddy? If you're carrying something, stay away from the guards in the yard. They'll search you without a second thought. Eh, hey, get lost. Step away, okay? I've done my rounds in the ring. You don't want to fuss with me. <laughs> Was that hydrochloric acid or something? Fuck off, man. We're busy. Oh, this is good. Showman got himself another trophy last night. Hmm. Junebug scalp this time? Yeah, and a tough mother, too. Showman ended up on the floor? <laughs> Had to use a shell. Had to. Or wanted to. You know the Junebugs got to Sherman. The ones in the Tower 23? The only one I know of. They keep to themselves and don't bother nobody. That irritates another like Sherman. Then they should stay clear of him. Or they end up under him. <laughs> and believe you me, that is not the place you want to be. Can't help you, buddy. Wanna trade? Talk to Monster here. Diner's closed. But life could be worse. What's on your mind? What are you trading? Not much today. I got a vent tool, a club, and a shiv. All custom made. Hmm. A vent tool sounds like it could be very useful. Let's grab that. The vent. Tool. Use it well. Weapons would certainly be nice. But I don't need it yet. You okay there, buddy? I'm, I'm gonna give Nurse his damn money. You better. Want to trade? Me and Monster run the trade market in Butcher Bay. 
He's got the goods. I got the smokes. Tell me about Monster. Yeah, he's running goods from his spot in the diner. He's probably in there with Chang. So, what do you say? How about some sp You gotta rot! Give me the smokes. Okay, here you go. Okay, who did I need to talk in talk to about the poisoning? Nurse. I believe that's you, isn't it? Yes. Good work. I got the money back from Binks. Hey, here's a little bonus. Now, if you need money, feel free to ask anytime. I'll loan you interest free. I'm never gonna pay him back. All right, let's do some fighting. If I can figure out how to get back. Is this where I came from? Oh yeah, it is. Okay. Okay, who am I supposed to fight? I know I'm supposed to defeat all the blues. And also somebody in particular. I suppose it doesn't matter. I guess I'll just fight everybody. Five bucks, and I'll suggest a new fighter. You win the show, you're 20 bucks richer. Bring me the next one. Next is Basim. You'll find him in the courtyard. Need any help? Basim. So you want to fight me? That's good, because I can use the prize money. See you in the ring, punk. your challenge. You win, you get 20 UDs. Get into the ring, Mr. Riddick. A newcomer Riddick is going to fight Basim, the bad boy with five wins in the last six months. You know the rules. It's dying time. Come on. Trying to get the timing right, it's really hard. I'm not even sure if it's possible, it's just not working. Oh, okay. <laughs> like I give a shit. Alright, who's next? Five bucks, and I'll suggest a new fighter. Bring me the next. I got a K3 bastard for you to fight next. He's called Sawtooth. All right, in the diner, gotcha. Let's go get healed up. Hey, what's up? Got a med station back here. I'll let you. Done.
Unfortunately, I'm gonna have to play Run Between to fight all these people. A little bit annoying. So you're this Riddick they talk about. Yeah, all right. You got yourself a fight. We'll see you in the ring. So you got your challenge. You win, you get 20. Today, folks, we're in luck. Oh fuck, he's got a shiv. Shit. And there's 16 kills in the circle. Fight! Yeah, I don't think I'm gonna win this. Pretty sure I can't do any sort of a timing attack, so I don't think I. Oh, wow. Oh, I'll if take it. K3 had won, <laughs> I'd have lost money. So I believe I owe you one, Riddick. I'm thinking um, you can't even do sort of a, a special move if you don't have the same weapon as them. I'm not actually sure if that's true. I don't really get the melee system, to be honest. I don't understand it. It's pretty cool, but. The whole timing thing, it doesn't sometimes it just doesn't seem to work at all. I don't know if it's just an extremely short window or what. It's very strange. I believe I have a shiv now though, don't I? Yes I do. Five bucks, and I'll suggest a new fighter. Bring me the neck. The competition's getting thin now, Riddick. Only Kusa is left. And I doubt you're gonna be able to take him. But if you want to try, he's in the courtyard. Kusa, gotcha. Hey man, how's it going? Got a med station back here. Done. I told you I don't have any. Uh, you want to fight me, huh? I'm gonna crack your fucking skull. Now go back to Centurion. I'll see you in the ring. Once again, I'm hesitant to use the shiv, because it almost seems like it's worse than the fists, but... Maybe I should. So, you got your challenge. You... Today, we have a fight to remember. The unstoppable Riddick, 
against Kusa, the meat grinder, in a fight to the, the death. meat grinder, oh no. Alright, fuck, he's not using a shiv, I won't. <laughs> that was like the hardest opponent. So you've killed all the best fighters in this joint, Mr. Riddick. Now there's only one remaining, and that's Bam. And he's one dangerous proposition. I wonder if this actually reflects how many wins I have. Have I killed four? Sounds about right. I got a message from Bam. He'll fight. Problem for me is that you might win. And Hoxie ain't gonna like that. Your problem isn't the Hawks. It's me. Yes. You are a problem. Hoxie will probably send Abbott down for you. That is, if you win. I mean... Abbott and me. We have unfinished business. So what's the deal, Riddick? You gonna fight or not? It's five UDs. Oh. He'll send the Abbott down, which means I can get his keycard. I'll fight. Oh shit, I didn't heal up. Uh-oh. Yeah, I'm probably gonna die. what you've all been expecting, huh? Riddick versus Bam. Need I say more? You all know the rules. Fight till death! Jesus. I just gotta wait till he tries to attack me and then go in right afterwards. Come on. It kinda works. Not really. Not really at all. Let's see if he'll heal up if I just keep circle strafing. Come on, will he heal up? Please heal me up. Come on, give me the rest of my bar back. Please. Please, I need my health back. Oh no, this is not good. It's not coming back. Fuck. I'm so dead. The fuck do I break through his defenses? You back out of this. The hacks are gonna piss on us. It's them against us. I need to bring up my shiv. Need any help? Got a med station back here. Done. Wait, what? Can't I get one more bar? I guess I was full. Let's try my shiv. I got a message from. Your problem. Yes. Abbott and. So what? I'll fight. All right, all right, all right. I bet this is what you've all been expecting, huh? Riddick versus Ben. Need I say more? You all know the rules. Fight till death. I can't even tell if I'm hurting him. Fuck. Let's try the timing thing. That's not working. It's not working. God damn it. Oh, there we go. Kind of. <laughs> oh man. The hacks are gonna piss on us. It's them against us. 
Yeah, it seems like if you get the timing right, the only thing it does for that person is just blocks their attack and that's it. It's such a short window too. Jesus. Alright, I guess I'll try that again. If not, I might... I mean, if that doesn't work, I might have to just buy a club. I got a message. You're pro... Yes. Abbott and me. So what's... The oh, fuck. Alright, alright, alright. I bet this is what you've all been expecting. Huh? Riddick versus Dan. Need I say more? You all know the rules. Fight to death! I can't even do it. No. <laughs> no. Back out of this. The hacks are gonna piss on us. It's them against us. I do want to get the timing right though. Yes. So what? Oh. I really still don't understand how the timing system works, and it's driving me a little bit crazy. Actually, I think I understand it now. Yep, I understand it now. Finally. Okay, you had your fun. Come with us. I finally get it. I... I mean, I don't really get the timing system as far as doing... I don't even know if... I'm not even sure if you can actually do those... The same sort of things you can do with armed guards. Where they go to melee attack you and if you get it at just the right time, you end up shooting them with their own gun. I don't know if you can do that sort of thing with melee. I, I don't even know. But as far as the timing... As far as actually just being effective at melee with the timing, the trick is to just attack... Uh, hold your fists up and just attack right when they start attacking. Because then they're not blocking. Once they start attacking, they're not blocking anymore, and use that opening to attack them. Because your attacks are actually faster than theirs. And that's how it works. I just figured it out. Talk to me. Bam's dead. Riddick killed him in the ring. Hmm. You're not still mad about before, are you? Well, let's see. Am I still mad about before? <laughs> no. In fact, I'm feeling much better. You're a hard-ass, Riddick, but we're about to soften you up. You don't know what you're fucking with. Dad is right, Riddick. They don't know. But you are going to show them. There is a fury within you, Riddick. Set it free. Well, shit. Alright, I think, yep, I got my shiv out.
Yep, just wait till I start attacking. <laughs> He's so incredibly slow. No idea why I did that. Anyway, I'll just be on my way. Stab my entire body. Thank you. Feels good. You know, if somebody had told me that the future of medical technology involved being stabbed with huge spikes constantly, I would say, um, stop, stop science, stop developing medical technology, because that shit's scary, yo. Hey, talk to Cuellas, all right? He runs the show. Come back when you have the whole snitch list. Alright, well, I think it might be time to head down to the mines. There's somebody, however, who wanted me to take out all of the blues. Given that I just fist fought everybody I could, maybe I've already done that. Like I said. Talk to Cricket if you want to buy a ship. I'm not really sure. Let's go see. There's a big mining area. Get lost! I want all of them dead. If you want the reward, you bring me proof that all of them are gone. Oh, he wants me to kill them all. Okay. Hmm. I guess the fist fighting alone didn't do that. Alright, well now that I've got the keycard, I think it might be time to head down. I think the keycard is all I need for that, to head down into the mines. Pretty sure. Alright, well, I hope you've enjoyed so far. I'm certainly enjoying myself. There's definitely a couple weak points with this game. It's got an over-tendency to be cinematic, with some fairly long cutscenes. And some... the occasional weird design decision, like those obnoxious turrets that do a shit ton of damage. And then the fight with this thing, oh god. Which is just wretched piece of crap. Fuck you! That was a terrible fight. Uh, but aside from that, it's a really solid game. Some pretty good self mechanics, some light kind of... Uh, almost RPG-like questing mechanics. So solid shooting, um, solid stealth. It's... It's interesting, it's not just like a standard shooter. It's got a bunch of stuff thrown into it. It's really interesting. So to end this episode, let's try to beat up on this thing. Fuck you! Okay, it didn't quite work. Anyway, hope you've enjoyed, and I will be back soon.